Hello, good afternoon. It is book time. We are going to read a book about a garden. I have a garden. Do you have a garden? In my garden, we're growing tomatoes and some cucumbers and some basil. So actually three things are growing in our garden. What's growing in your garden? So let me show you the book we're reading. It is a peek inside book and it's called The Garden. This is the front of the book. This is the back of the book and it is written by Anna. In the front of the book, there's a gate. And if you look, it shows the garden from the outside of the book. Let's open up the book and see. A sunny garden hums, buzzes, creeps, and crawls with life. Can you see any animals peeking between the plants? I can see, let's see a fox. And, oh, here's a little mouse. And I see a ladybug. What's under a ladybug's spotted back? Wings. Did you know that? Sunshine makes the flowers bloom. Here's some flowers. Bees hum busily as they gather yellow pollen. I don't know if you can see this very well. Let's see. The bees are on the flower and they gather pollen to take home to feed to the baby bees. When bees are on a flower, the pollen sticks to their legs. Their legs are sticky. Peek inside this flower to see who's landed on the flower. Oh, a beautiful butterfly. She enrolls her long tongue to suck up sweet nectar from the middle of the flower. There's her long tongue. All kinds of bugs live in a garden. What's this busy spider making? Mmm, a spider web. And who can you find hiding in the log pile? Let me see how I look in the log pile. Oh. You see it, so do I. It's a centipede that's a long worm with legs and some wood lice. Those are little bugs. Oh, a sleepy toad underneath a leaf. In a shady pond, a pond skater tiptoes across the water. And a surprised frog goes splash and dives into the water to hide. Lots of baby newts live in the pond. When they're bigger, they'll climb out of the water to explore. Right down here is some baby newts. Now this is a different part of the garden. At the bottom of the garden, there's a compost heap. Compost helps plants to grow. Now I'm going to open this up and it shows you what you put in your compost heap. You put in kitchen scraps, grass cuttings, and paper shreds. Wiggly worms munch through it all, whoops, mixing it up and making compost. You mix this in with dirt in your garden. 
and it helps the plants grow. What's inside this shed? I see a watering can. Do you see it right here? A shovel, some packets of seeds, balls of string, and other things you might need when you work in the garden. What is growing in your vegetable patch? Peek under this leaf to see. Oh, you know what this is. It's a huge pumpkin. When it turns orange, it's ready to eat. There are cabbages too. Hmm, what's making those holes in the leaf? Oh, lots of little caterpillars. They love eating cabbage leaves. And so does that snail. Up in the tree, there's a noise. Cheep, 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 cheep. Who lives in this little house? Baby birds. The mother and father bring him food all day long. Someone is taking the bird seed in our bird feeder. Peek under the leaves to see who it is. Oh. Yes, ma'am. That is a busy squirrel. They love bird seed. What a lot of things there are to find in just one garden. I think I may need to go outside and look in my garden to see if I can find some of these bugs, insects, animals. How fun. Thanks for reading this book with me. I'll talk to you later, alligator. Bye-bye.